City building is a journey led by your creativity and ambition. So the decisions you make along the way reflect who you are. To help you build a city that's true to you, City Skylines 2 puts 20 milestones packed with rewards directly in your path. When you unlock a milestone, you're rewarded expansion permits. Expansion permits allow you to quickly add new map tiles to your city. But this isn't just about real estate. Use expansion permits to release tiles with the specific attributes you need to see your plans through. Milestones also reward you with development points. You need development points to add city services, the bedrock of a functioning metropolis. But just adding them isn't enough. The needs of citizens will change as the city expands, so you'll need to keep developing city services to keep pace. Your development points make it happen. The city services you choose to add, how you develop them, and just how advanced you make them all make a big impact on the character of your city. This is how it works. Each city service has a development tree. The nodes on the development tree are more and more advanced buildings that level up the city service in a specific way. As you unlock these nodes, that city service becomes more sophisticated and specialized. When you first add a city service, you're at the base of the development tree, so you get the basics. Like when you add the city service public transportation, you get buses and taxis. Basic stuff. Spend development points to unlock nodes further along the development tree. In this case, you might invest in trains to move more people more efficiently. Or you might go in a totally new direction by taking to the skies. It's all up to you. Remember, the further you go along a development tree, the more development points you'll need to cough up. And they don't exactly rain from the sky. You might not add a city service at all, or you might not develop it very much. Others, you'll take all the way. Once you add a city service and unlock nodes on its development tree using development points, it's time to open your wallet. To actually pay for the construction of city service buildings, building extensions, and operational upgrades, you need cash. Don't worry, you can cover it with the monetary rewards you get when you unlock each milestone. By now, you're probably asking, how do I unlock milestones? It's all about expansion points, or XP. You'll rack up XP passively and actively. Passive XP are awarded up to 16 times during each in-game day. They're awarded as your city's population and the happiness level of that population increases. That's why smooth running cities that foster the well-being of citizens make steady progress toward the next milestone. Active XP are doled out right when you make bold investments in your city. Watch them rack up when you plop a signature building or invest in core infrastructure like the city's road network. In City Skylines 2, milestone rewards empower you to unleash your creativity and ambition on the path to building a city that only you can.